What is up chosen ones and welcome to some Pokemon Dreams. This is a new Pokemon GB room hack that just came out of the market and I'm just dying to test it out. It has a new region, the solar region I think. Did I pronounce that correctly? Yeah, I think I did. It has Pokemon from Gen 1 up to Gen 7 which is great actually. Some fake mons that we all love, you know what I'm saying? And it has some big towns and cities and all of those great stuff. New professor and this game is looking pretty OP. That dunce boss is staring at me so intensively so I'm just gonna jump into this Pokemon Dreams right away. I know the controls. Yeah, I know the controls already. Uh, Pokemon Dreams includes all Pokemon to Generation 7. Some only appear at night, so play on a device that can record the time for the best experience. Multiplayer is untested, so you likely will encounter issues if you try. If you have any questions or comments, visit the thread on the Poke Community forums. Most of all, have fun. So this is version 1.0, alright, I'm looking forward to it. Alright, the new professor. Hey buddy, glad to glad you come. Welcome to the world of Pokemon, you can call me Conifer. I'm a Pokemon professor working in the solar region. The solar region is a fun, interesting place. Where people live together with Pokemon. Our relationship with Pokemon has been important. Has been important since antiquity, alright? All legend Asian texts, they all feature relationships with Pokemon. They all feature relationships with Pokemon. I said how those relationships have changed over time. You could say, I'm not an historian. It's exciting work. Alright, I hear him. But hey, that's not about me. Let's talk about you. You, my friend, are a traveler who for some reason or another just arrived in the Seoul region. Where are you from? Where are you going? Hey, don't look at me like I have no idea. In fact, I've told you everything I have to say. Now, it's time for you to fill in the blanks. Alright, so no problems. Tell me, bud. How do you like to present yourself? I like to present myself as a boy. Coolio. Good to know. Now, what's your name? My name is, of course, the one and only. So far, so great. This region is looking great. Not region, but as far as so great, I'm enjoying this. I, yes. Cherokee, good to know. As for this boy, well, I'm sure you'll be friends. What's his name? We're going to give him his name. It's the usual, actually, which is... Wait, mistake. KJ. Nice. Okay, I can get behind that. His name is Cajun. Alright, we're done here, Shariki. It's time for you to start your journey together with Pokemon. Stop by my lab. Where? Alright. Nice. So here we are. I think we're in the train, actually. We can't move. Oh, this guy, I think he might be a rival. He has a Dunsparce too with him, falling behind him. I don't think our Pokemon follows us in this game. So, excuse me. It's okay if we sit here? Yeah, sure, why not? Thank you very much. Is that your Eevee? It looks content. It must be happy with you. You can tell a lot about a person from how they treat their Pokemon. Lots of Pokemon are dependent on trainers. Bad trainers don't treat them like equals. They do the same to people they think are beneath them. So, they mistreat Pokemon the same way they mistreat people. That's all you can tell. Hmm, you look uncomfortable. If you don't want to talk about that, we can talk about other things. I just like to talk. Alright, so I'm guessing we're not the person who you know love to talk. Centralist. We have arrived in Centralist City. Over. Alright, so here's our stop. Well, it looks like it's time to go. That was a lovely chat. Thank you very much. May I ask your name? Shariki. Thank you. I'll remember it. Alright, sure. Why not? I hope we can meet again someday. I hope so too, dude. I hope so too. Anyway, let's go, Evie. It's time for us to make our exit. Alright, so we have the running shoes already. It's pretty fantastic. I like games where you just get your running shoes. Nope, not yet. Fast. I'm not gonna be really messing around the frames. The frames are pretty damn good already. So let's go ahead and make our way out here. Talk to this guy here. Ah, excuse me. You are the last person off. Allow me to be the first to welcome you to Central City. Here's a complimentary map of the surrounding region. And just like that, we got the town map. Nice. Now we're gonna be exploring this big old thick city. 
Bah, waiting, waiting, waiting. There's always so much waiting. I don't like to wait, so I set my tech speed on fast. Thank you for taking our inter-regional line. We trust that you enjoy your trip and will consider Solar Subway in the future. Yeah, uh, I don't really know if I can, I don't really know if I'm going to be taking back your station or whatever, because when the game done, I think there's a post game as well, so probably we might get, you know, to take back your somewhere or whatever it is. All right, this place is looking pretty damn big. This is big old big. We're going to talk some people here. And that's just the right thing to do. You know what I'm saying? Exercise, adrenaline, vitamin rich, protein drink, feel the burn. I'm the best I've ever been. All right. Good to know. Hello. Across the sea, there's a place called the Emerald Eye. I wonder what it's like. I wonder too. Probably when I get surf, I might come back. Hello, young lady. I love coming here. The sea breeze feels so nice. Uh, since I'm not really in the game, I can't feel the sea breeze, but... Huh. I heard something cool happens when you press the L button, but I don't know what an L button is. Ah, uh, let's... Wait, once we don't talk to this guy, we'll press the L button. Well, good day to you. Are you a traveler? Yes, I am. Good. It's good to travel while you're young. Welcome to Solda. Alright. Yeah, thank you, dude. Thank you much. Yeah, I bet when you were young, you traveled a lot too. Alright, let's try it. Oh, so when you press the auto run, it enables... Uh, auto run. When you press the L button... I mean, it enables auto run, no props. But we don't want to actually. So we're going to disable that. Centralist is the regional capital, but there's not much here. Besides the government mansion and the subway station, that's it. I think Solda View, I think Solda View Port is the real heart of Solda. Right, it's good to know, old lady. Although I think you're an old lady. Winston, Winston, remember to re-elect winston for governor re-elect winston for governor you're not registered to vote in solda are you then don't waste my time yeah. a bot house a bot a bot that sounds damn weird government Win winston is pushing to convert the pokemon center to a free for service model we're supporting a bot but i'm not supporting any bot so the pokemon center won't lose any public funding i won't support a bot i will not do that hi there i'm a bot <laughs> Ah. Did you know that Winston brother-in-law owns over half of Central City real estate? Each year, Winston allows rent hikes and the family's profits. It's blatant corruption. If I'm re-elected governor, we'll buy out their land and convert it into cheap government housing. So remember to vote for me in the next election. I don't think I can vote in this region. Hello, are you registered to vote? No, I'm not. Hung up on again. Hi, right, hello. I'd explain why I'm voting for Abbott, but I'm not voting for any Abbott, so I'm voting for the next government that doesn't have anything to do with but. Well, the reason isn't exactly rated E for everyone, alright? I'm making phone calls. This is really important, so don't interrupt. If Abbott is elect, <laughs> every time they say that it cracks me up, dude. It'll be much easier to change my legal name and gender. He's going to let me put X as my gender and on my ID card too. Please, vote for him. It would mean a lot. Why would you want to change your gender? That's weird. Alright, some more exploring. So we have the Pokemon Switch Lab. Let's go in there. Hey, buddy. Could you help me out for a sec? It won't take long. So I'm guessing this is the professor. Alright, yes, let's go. Sweet, thanks. Get over here. I'm Professor Conifer, by the way. I just Conifer for short. You. Sharky Hunt, nice to meet you. Here's my dilemma. One of my old colleagues sent me this device. It's a high-tech encyclop high encyclopedia that I can use to get some good info on the Pokemon of the Soul region. But while well, I can't seem to assemble it. Look close and you can see that it's split into two parts. I need to stab this half into, a into other half. I try to do it myself, but I'm kind of a wimp. So, here's what we're going to do. You hold that half and I'll put all my weight on this half. They'll have no choice but to snap together. Ready? Alright. Let's snap these things together. Deep breaths. Why do we have to take deep breaths? Let's do this. Wow. That was quick. Anyways, we got the Pokedex. Nice. Ow, 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 ow. How many owls are you going to say, dude? My head. Shaky, are you alright? Yes, I am. Good to hear. And the Pokedex. Hey, it worked. The two pieces are snapped in place. It should be fully functional now. Thanks, now I can... Aha. This is the place, Professor Conifer. Hand over your search. So I'm guessing these are the bad guys now. You idiot. What are you doing? We are going to wait for him to leave. Who are you people? Get on my lab. Don't worry about us, Professor Codifer. We only want to browse through your research. 
Pace, no mind. I do mind, you stink one. <laughs> that sounds weird. I've had the search stolen from me before. Ah, so you really are a punk. It's not exactly a good feeling. I'll have none of it. Get out. Don't be difficult, professor. It may not end well for you. Oh no, Shiriki. I'm sorry to rope you into this, but please, help me out here. Grab a Pokemon on my table. I needed to help me battle these, these nitwits. What are you with these names, dude? Shiriki, hey bud. Do you need anything or just saying hello? If you need anything, just give me a shout. I'm not always very helpful, but I do what I can. Alright, so we have a Shikori. Are the starters going to be like from different different regions? So I'm guessing that the starter from this, from, from the Jodo region is a Shikori. Or is the starter the Jodo region starters? Alright, so I was never really a big fan of you, so I'm going to dish you. Ah, my favorite Jodo region starter, but I feel we're going to be picking Totodile for this one. It has access to water going quick, quick, and it has some pretty, and it has a pretty decent attack. I think it's the strongest of all. I've never really used it before, but we're going to go with Toad Lion. Why not? We're going to go with the big boy. Thanks, Shiriki. Here, take this. Hey, the five potion. Use this potion if your Pokemon get hurt. No go. You can do it, Shiriki. Ha! You think you can beat me? I'll crush you before you can cry uncle. And then we'll get everything we need to know from the professor. Alright, so I'm going to say uncle. 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 Well, I guess you guys aren't going to defeat me. Because I just said uncle. You guys said you would crush me before I could say uncle. Alright, we're going to go with some tackles here. Hey, boy. We got poison. No problems. We can just tackle those boys to death. You next. No, we lost. Ejad. We have been defeated. How did this happen? You haven't won yet. We were just a few of many. You can't hide from Team Coil. So they're Team Coil, eh? Shaki, thank you so much. You're incredible. I couldn't have fought them off without you. Told that Holly seems hurt. Oh, I see. You had your Eevee with you. You really are prepared for anything, aren't you? But I wonder, who are those crooks? What part of my research are they after? Professor Conifer. Is everything alright? Your neighbor Brown called. He said he saw some suspicious characters enter the lab. Yes. Ah. We had an incident. Two hoodlum... Why? <laughs> Hoodlums... No, you know what? Why this guy's name? He comes up with two weird names and now he comes up with this extraordinary weird name. Hoodlums. Jesus. Just barge in wearing odd green suits. They were trying to steal my research. We'll put out a, a search for them. We'll also pay close attention to you and your lab, Professor. We have nothing to fear from them. Great. That's fine and dandy. I'm going to go look for those criminals. Best of luck, you two. Thank you, officer. Good luck. Hmm, Shariki, I have an idea. That toad that you battled with just now, take it with you. It'll help, peop it, it'll help protect you if those thugs try to bother you again. You should train it to help it grow stronger. You can even visit the name rate, the name rater and give it a nickname. Oh, and take that Pokedex too. And these. We got five Pokeballs. Nice. Those are Pokeballs. You can use them to catch new Pokemon. They should help a lot. You should try using them on Route 1. It's the west of here. It's the west of city. Good luck, Shariki. Keep sharp. I will. So when we run, I don't think poison affects us. And we can run inside houses, which is great. This Pokemon Center is down here. We're going to go and do a quick healing up. Everything's looking so good so far. Alright, so we're going to talk to these people here. Greetings. I sell I spell specialty Pokeballs on behalf of Devon Carp. Of course, our business has only recently opened its solar branch. So our stocks is a bit limited. Even so, we'd like to make a purchase. Our right, I would. So let's support them here. We already have Pokeballs, by the way, but why not? Let's support them and get two. I mean, if I opened up a shop, I'd like people to, you know, support me. Yo, I'm the movie learner. Nice to meet you. If you want to be a strong trainer, you're gonna need me. So, how about it? Want me to teach your Pokemon move? Yes. Which Pokemon needs tutoring? Alright, so I'm gonna go with my Eevee here. If we can get... Yes, it has covered and cutely executed attack that also steals the false hold items. That is what I'm talking about. I do need covered. It's like one of my favorite moves. Alright, so what do I take off? We're gonna go. Oh, no, 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 no. We're gonna go with go. Nice choice. I like how you think. Alright, let's go with Toad down here. What is it? Eh, it does appear as if I have a move I can teach that Pokemon. Which Pokemon needs to learn? Alright, great. Whoa, 
Ah, hello. Ah, who am I again? Who am I again? Oh yeah, that's right. And the move, the leader. I can make Pokemon forget their moves. Want me to do that? Nope, I'm good. So if you ever want your moves or anything to be like, if you want to learn new moves for your EV, which on the first move that you can only learn is a covet helping hand. But if you want to learn new moves or delete moves, then down here, be sure to check down here. So far, so great. Anyways, we're gonna go explore the town a little bit more, seeing that this place is humongous, seriously, right? You know what I'm saying? Some nights, I sneak out of the bed and go to the kitchen. Then I bang the pots and the pans together. Why do you do that? Are you mad? My little brother saw an ad for Castilla Cones during his Hoi Night Ranger show. If he won't shut up about them, please make it stop. I want a Castilla Cone. I saw it on TV. Do you know how to get one? So probably that might be a mission actually, I don't think, you know, this game doesn't have any missions or stuff like that, but if we can like, you know, probably find a Castilla account and return it back to, I don't know if it's possible, but if we find a Castilla account, we be sure to come back at, what's the city's name again? Cast, don't remember actually. Let's shut the town up, I have no idea what this, what this city's name is. So, alright, so this city's name is St. Charlie City, so. If you get a Castilla Con, we come back to Central City and the region is looking humongous stores. Bro, look at that. You have the Emerald Eye. I think that's the poke like for uh I think it's with it's with page with poke. I think it's a place with the Pokemon League. And what's this? Pokemon Ranch. Hey. Pokemon Ranch is like places where we can find some pretty great Pokemon. Some nights around midnight, a loud clanging noise comes out of my floorboards. It's terrifying. M maybe it's a ghost Pokemon. Ah, probably it's a ghastly. Ghastly are known to like play tricks on people and stuff like that. But we're pretty brave. We're bulky. So we don't further those stuff. You know what I'm saying? Spirit change. I guess you're a madman. But I don't have any. Alright. We talked to you already. We don't need to talk to you again. Hello, fat man. Technology incredible. I can play Pokemon without my Game Boy Advance. A customer. Welcome to the bad boy. Oh. But we aren't open yet. So I'm sorry. I guess we can check back later probably there might be something where you have to like check back what's this place this place looks big governor winston's humble abode don't know trespassing i'm just passing hey look at me i'm just passing on your territory what can you do well i guess they're punks after all, all right let's go check out the house whoa this place is the manga stores uh hello are you here to see my husband he's very busy these days but he should be able to see you you can find him upstairs all right no problems isn't the mayor lucky to have a wife like her? I certainly think so. Well, why? Why wouldn't I? She's my sister. Oh, for a second there, I thought, you know. But anyways, let's talk to this old dude. That darn Farmer Brown. He's stunting the city's development so much. Prime real estate is being wasted. He needs to cut his lawn too. I swear I saw wild the graf the graf a rig in the grass. Well, usually in patches of grass, we find Pokemon. So, there is no problem with that, actually. So... What's been weird so far in this city is a bot. I so weird, dude. Anyway, we haven't explored this section of the solar station, yeah. Yeah, we talked to you. We did talk to you already. We talked to you already. You're the one that, you know, welcome us as a traveler. We talked to lots of people here. Hello, young trainer. I could test how friendly your Pokemon is to you. Would you like to do that? Yes. Very well. I begin with the Pokemon in the front of your party. Hmm. It's not quite familiar with you yet. Pokemon are all quite weary when you first get them. All right, that's nice to know. Hello, hello, I'm the official name reader. Alright, want me to read the nicknames of your Pokemon? Sure, why not? I want you to do my Eevee first. Just so you know, there's only one name that can go for my Eevee, and that is, of course, the perfect name. Yeah, caution, nice. Second Pokemon up is my told that I'm gonna name this one Hydrate. Nice. Done. From now on, this Pokemon should be known as Hydrate. Shall be known as Hydrate. Hydrate. Yeah, it's a better nickname than before. Thank you very much. So, if you want the name reader and, you know, the lady who tests 
of friendly year pokemon are check these people here their name radar and stuff like that so far it's so great actually all right so we should be going out to the routes now i think route one is to the west of the city and the west is not here actually so it's down here did we talk to everyone actually because i want to make sure that i get everyone out of town you know i want to make sure that i talk to every oh mark how did i forget about you oh one thing how could i i'm no pro if i didn't do this i am no pro if i didn't withdraw the potion from one of my pc there we go don't forget to check your pc boys and girls because you'll definitely find something great in it which is a potion so want to talk to everyone a bot no no i don't want to talk to you if you're if you're talking about a bot what should i buy you know what let's go and talk to him since he probably has something good to say about saying he's going to raise minimum wage wages if he wins that'll make it harder for our local businesses to, to profit so i'm voting for winston now if you'll excuse me i have to stock these shelves all right nice someone who's voting for winston just as i am what should i buy today you know we don't deal with bots. we don't deal with bots you do but what happened that dude all right nice here we go do we talk to she farmer brown isn't a farmer anymore everyone still calls him farmer brown though he said that he saw a wild giraffe rig in the grass so i'm guessing this is the man that that old man with a shine here in part in the middle of his ears shined out actually hello farmer brown my man they wanted me to sell out but i ain't gonna do it not now not ever Farmer Brown is keeping his family's land. All right, nice, bro. You gotta stand up. You can you, because you're old. They feel like you know you can't defend yourself. Just remember. All right, this is route one, so this is where we're supposed to be going. There is also fake demons in this game, which I'm looking out for actually. Yeah. All right. Gonna scratch that bad boy to death. Nice. Water gun. I told you he learns water gun, water gun quickly, so we can easily one shot everything here now. All right. Who else is up for some more? water gun we got an orange very nice that took a little bit longer than i expected but we're good and we're gonna keep on feeding him some water guns i think my toe that might have might have a strong attack but he has ability torrent has an attack of 15 a defense of 17 a special attack of 13 special defense of 10 and a speed of 11 well, on the other hand, my caution has a solid attack of 11, a defense of 11, a special attack of 11, and a special defense of 12, and a speed of 11. Not bad. Adaptability boosts same type moves. Nice. We're going to get a moonstone and evolve it into an Umbreon since that is like my favorite, you know, evolution. Why not? Antidote. Now, it's just going to take back down here. So we can avoid the grasses. If we can find a fake Kimon, I'll definitely capture it. Even if it doesn't look 100% good, we're going to go with it. Potion, nice. What kind of Pokemon can I find around here? Hey, a fake Kimon. This looks great. We're going to go with Rage, just doesn't kill it. We're going to capture it. I'm afraid to use a next Rage. I knew it. All right, find one more. We're going to go with a Rage. Please. Gonna have to, all right, I'm gonna have to work my magic here. All right, there we go. All right, it is incredibly docile, so it is popular among novice trainers. It its thick fur is popular in scarves and jackets. All right, no bug, why not? Uh, why can I give this book one? Uh. I have actually no name, so I'm just gonna name it Fur. Since they say like it has thick fur, so I'm gonna name it Fur. Totally weird name, but why not? This is a lovely day. A battle would be lovely too. Let's go ahead and take you out. More XP, you know what I'm saying? Alright, so we're gonna switch out to uh Caution. Gonna get some XP. 
All right. So, oh my god, this guy just bumped into me. Oops, sorry, my bad. Excuse me. <laughs> so, ah, oops, sorry, my bad. Excuse me. What is this guy? This guy is just, he's all like, ooh, ah, ah, ooh, eh, excuse me. Look, a trainer. Time to show off my darling Pokemon. I love to see a darling Pokemon. Come on, ah. No problem. Gonna get as much XP that as we can. Alright, one more trainer, no problems. We can deal with you very easily. Quick and nice. Do we get XP so fast in this game? What if we get the XP share? That'd be so great. Hiya, are you a new trainer? No, don't answer me. I'm sure you are. And do you know how a trainer proves they're the very best? They take the Pokemon Gym Challenge. They feed the eight gym leader of the solar region and collect their eight badges. Then battle the champion and become a legend. I'll guide you every step of the way. So, what do you say? Sound A-OK? -okay? Yes, it does. It does. Great. Sweet. Awesome. Awesome as a bell- a bellossom. Or a bellossom awesome? Let me introduce myself then. My name is Jim. Each time you challenge a Pokemon Jim, I'll be there to give you advice. Thicket Town's Jim is at the south end of town. Why not start there? Oops, I forgot something. Beat the thicket gym leader. When I think he mean after we defeat him, we must go to Miss Mister Cutter's house. It's on Root Tree. Why don't you go see when he'll be back? Oh, but you'll have to pass through Road Two to reach Route Tree, and Route Two is full of trainers. So before you go, you should take this. Nice. That's XP share. It shares XP. Just as I was talking about the XP share, it came in clutch and I finally got it. Oh my god, nice. It's all uh, it's turned off by default, so if you're having trouble, turn that baby on. Alright, so there you have it. We have uh, well reached this point game. I actually wanted a little bit of grinding up on my fake key mon because this game is looking a okay. This is a gym leader, which I think is uh a massive bug catcher, so why didn't we just fix in the pool? Anyways, we're great. This is looking so great so far, and I love it so much. So I catch you guys next time. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. See you later. See ya.